Brighton High School Theater's spring performance brings Neil Simon's The Odd Couple to stage. The show will feature a male cast and a female cast, and we caught up with both during dress rehearsal. So I play Florence Unger, and she was recently sort of kicked out of her house by her husband, Sydney, and she's kind of depressed in the beginning, and she's sort of compulsive, and she's really neat. She's pretty hysterical, to say the least. I'm not going. What do you mean you're not going? I don't know what to say to them. The ship comes home when the sailor is lost? What does that mean? I play Olive Madison, and she's the Oscar character in The Female Odd Couple, and she's the sloppy one, so she doesn't care what anything really looks like. Her apartment's a wreck, and she's also divorced and is in dire search of a man. I don't know. I'm not a Spanish philosopher. I'm a frustrated American woman. And so Florence has just gotten separated from her husband, and she's kind of out of it. And so um, Olive invites her to live in her apartment with her, thinking that everything's going to be all fine and dandy. But it's things not. happen. <laughs> Every night, I write in my diary the things you did that day that irritated me. This is June, okay? I filled up till January. The female cast performances are 7 p.m. Friday and 3 p.m. Saturday. The male cast performs 7 p.m. Thursday and 7 p.m. Saturday. We are Felix and Oscar of the male version cast of yeah. The Odd Couple. So I play Felix. He is, uh, definitely his defining quality is his cleanliness, his neatness. However, he is also extremely anxious, neurotic, and just in general a very tense man. And I play Oscar Madison, who is just basically the polar opposite of Felix. He's just, he loves everything, just sprung about, really dirty, really messy, and just doesn't care at all. And when these two come together, hilarity ensues. I was wondering how long it would take. How long would it take before I got on your nerves? I didn't say you got on my nerves. Well, it's the same thing. You said I irritated you. No, no, no. I didn't say you irritated me. You said you irritated me. I didn't say anything. Then what did you say? What I don't remember what I said. What difference does it make what I said? It doesn't make any difference. I was just repeating what I thought you said. I'll repeat what you thought. I actually I saw it. You said repeat what I actually said. My God, that's irritating. So at the beginning of the show, Oscar's you know the slot. He doesn't care. He's just really lazy and doesn't want to do anything. But by the end of the show, he's just. You know, you can't right. stand. I, I, think, I think I think in terms of tension, it's definitely Oscars is going up, and then Felix's is just he's slowly letting go. That's funny, isn't it, Oscar? They think we're enjoying this. They think we're happy, Felix. Well, I I really appreciate if you did not clean up right now. It's only a few things. <laughs> can't get over what Murray just said. You know, I think you may really envy us, <laughs> Felix. Please, and not throw dirting up for the night. Rocket. So uh, this production is sort of an intimate affair with the black box. We have the audience about three feet away from this table, actually. The show is very like intimate with the characters, you know, mm -hmm. but also we want the audience to be part of the ensemble as well. You know, it's, it's really great. We got stuff flying everywhere, so... So, watch out. You guys better be careful. <laughs> you gotta be careful. We got, like, glasses going through windows and people... And whatnot. Yeah, so. it's, it's a little crazy. But it's fun. It's fun. It's a lot of fun. Neil Simon's The Odd Couple. Four performances this week in the Brighton High School Auditorium. Seating is limited to 120 people per show, and tickets are available at the door. For more information, visit the district website at bcsd.org.